Hi, this is Greg Lowe. This is another video on the STU Tool Series on Seconds to Duration. When working with time in SQL Server, you need to specify the time string in a specific format so that it looks like a duration. Commonly though, what you have is a period of time, like minutes or seconds, and you need to be able to create the string that holds that value. So this tool does that. So let's execute this and take a look. So this is taking the value of 910 seconds in this case, uh, which is 15 minutes and 10 seconds, and that's going to return back the appropriate time. Now there's a limit to how many seconds you can do this. It has to be something that fits within the day. So in the case of 88,000, which is more than the number of seconds in a day, the value we get back is null. So in this case, we can see the output, so it's shown as hours, minutes, seconds, and in this case we get back the value null. We hope you find this tool useful. For more information on STU tools and for a link to download them, please visit our site at www.sqldownunder.com.